<laughs> when you first saw me, what was I on a scale of one to ten? This was like my first impression from afar. I was kind of like, that's not it. Oh, he needs some milk. <laughs> whoa, damn, whoa, you need the red carpet. You look like a movie. You need the red carpet. All right, damn. back with another video today. I figured. We do something a little different. We've been doing vloggy vlogs, some fitness content for a while. So I'm like, let's just chill out today. Sit down video, do a mukbang with uh, my crush. Yeah, we're gonna get to know her. I feel like she's been in the vlogs, but I haven't had a video like this where we like sat down and just had this dialogue. Kind of really, really introduced you guys, but obviously you, definitely seen her three years later yeah three years later you definitely seen her in the vlogs anyway we got some walk box this actually took us like 30 minutes to get i was debating on canceling the order and going to mcdonald's because it's just taking so long pad thai she's got pad thai we got some fortune cookies we got some spring rolls okay i'll start it i'm selma selma <laughs> so tell us so <laughs> she's trying to make this awkward but it's not awkward i'm i'm comfortable in front of the camera but i kind of understand maybe this is a little weird but I didn't think it'd be weird, but now that I'm sitting here, it feels really weird. Tell them what you do. Like, uh, what are you doing in school? Where are you from? Like, give them something interesting. Like. <laughs> I was born in Germany. Oh. I'm... You don't speak German. Do you speak anything? Yeah, I speak Southern Slang. Oh. Um, but I'm Bosnian slash Croatian, which more people will probably know. Mm -hmm. Wait, she speaks Croatian. What? Can you can you say something cool? Tisi budala. Ooh. I just dissed you. Oh, damn. What'd you say? <laughs> eh, Google Translate it. <laughs> I moved to Canada when I was two. Mm -hmm. My dad still lives back home. I'm at University of British Columbia, Okanagan. Woot, woot. <laughs> um, I'm a double major. Mm -hmm. So my first major's technical title is Medical Biochemistry and Molecular Biology. My second major is Psychology, but I'm doing an honors thesis, which is kind of like a, like a mini master's thesis type thing. So I do my own independent research for a year. Then yeah, I'll have two degrees and an honors. Um, so in summary, She'll be taking care of us while I make YouTube. But in like 20 years. Yeah, she'll be taking us, care of us in 20 years while I chill and make YouTube videos. It's mm -hmm. funny because um, for the people who don't know, because I do feel like I got a lot of subscribers from when I have said this, like videos, many videos ago. But I'm from Atlanta, Atlanta, Georgia. I've been living in Kelowna for probably like six years now. Uh, we're both not even from here, but been here pretty much most of our lives. Neither of us are actually like Canadian, Canadian. blood. Yeah. Um, well, like we met in high school, which is we crazy. We have a weird history. You know, we got a weird history. We met in high school, which is crazy because I came to Kelowna my freshman year of high school, like Canadian freshman year, which is grade 10. I had like no friends. I think one of my first friend groups that I was like actually like friends with, like you were in that friend group, like in grade 10. The first time I ever saw you, I specifically remember. Yeah. He was hitting up one of my like best friend at the time. Yeah. She's like, oh, there's this cute guy. He just moved here, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. And she's telling me about mm -hmm. him. And then I remember specifically, we were getting on the bus and you were at the bus with Jackson, mm -hmm. shout out Jackson. She was like, that's him, that's him. And I remember thinking like, oh. Yeah. Wait a minute, hold up, hold up. When, I'm wait, sorry, wait. baby. When you first saw me, what was I on a scale of one to 10? Like this was like my first impression from afar. I was kind of like, that's not it. Oh! <laughs> he needs some Wait, milk. so what was that on a scale of one to 10? Was I, I fresh? Know. Was my... No, that's that was the part like you. I had no drip. Like your like obey hat, the green one. Bro, I came and to the Canada. diamond hoodie. Oh my and, god! And like I I don't know what shoes you were wearing, but I specifically so what you remember. What was I? Now, what do I think you were? No, what was I well, then? I don't know. I didn't. You were my best friend's boy. Because I can give you your number. That's not fair. So what was? Okay, that? you give me yours first. Two. Let's say it at the same time. One, Three, two, two one, one seven. four. Oh <laughs> shit! <laughs> He needs Wait, some milk. I just kind of panicked. I don't know. I didn't want to be lower, higher than you. <laughs> you gave me a four, man. I'm not even gonna go into that. You Anyways. know that's cap. <laughs> Let me just say the funny part is like during this whole thing of coming to Canada, and not having friends in high school. Well, like no, I, I had friends in high school. Let's we're we're very early in my high school career. But like coming here, I was dripped out when it comes to like American style. I mean, you wanna know how different it is like in Canada versus America at that time. Like a lot of people in Canada now dress like Americans, but at this time, oh, I'm telling you. Who says that America has the best style? No, they don't have the best style, but it was different. Like I was fresh in Atlanta and I came here and people were like wearing skinny jeans and Vans and like Volcom t-shirts and I'm like, I thought they said I wasn't fresh. That was more just like 
skater boy. I know, but I wasn't on that. Like, I came here wearing like Jordans, a jean jacket, and some jean pants. I had the oh, fresh. Oh, that freaking blue yeah, jean. Yeah, I had the fresh oh. blue jean with the fresh jeans to match. And then I had the, the Bordeaux 7 Jordans. If you're a sneakerhead, you already know how rare those were back in like 2012 or 2013. Like, no one was on that except in Atlanta. Look like, you how already hot knew. you are. You're I'm, so offended. I'm, I'm heated because people thought I was bummy. And I'm like, I got I didn't no think reasons. you were bummy. I just thought that you, like, I don't know, just weren't that cute. But you gave me a four. Okay, I'm sorry. I panicked. I didn't want to be lower than you. You were definitely over half. So you're at least a five. Okay. Okay. Well, Anyways, well. then fast forward. We actually kind of hated each other for a while because of like girl drama. You know how that goes. <laughs> <laughs> he dated my friends and whatever. Mm -hmm. Like we went from like being like hated each other to being cordial, and then all of a sudden we just like became best friends. Like I don't even. I remember our first like best friend hangout. Yeah, yeah. Was at Tim Hortons, and we were just gonna go like do homework. I don't even know. We were waiting yeah. around for basketball practice. I was basketball. He was basketball. Yeah. Our teams drove together to games and stuff. Yeah. So we ended up sitting at Tim Hortons for like hours mm -hmm. and just talked. And from there on, came best friends. Mm -hmm. He always had a girlfriend. It was super platonic. Nothing like, it was kind of like, ew, no, that's just my best friend. Yeah. Well, really, we first got involved, like near the end of grade 12. Mm -hmm. And we stayed involved on and off mm -hmm. until like, my second year of university. Yeah. So it took us three years to, finally date. to get our shit together before yeah. we actually officially. A long we were time. always on and off, and like we'd be exclusive, and we wouldn't. Yeah. And then, a lot. She didn't fall for me until I became cool in high school. Oh, is that how you see it? Yeah, you know, I started dressing better. I start being a little more attractive. Apparently I wasn't a four anymore. I started playing No, ball. I don't think he became attractive until after high school. Oh, like, <laughs> he needs some like milk. super attractive. Well, I didn't say you were four all the way through high school, but I didn't like think that you were like, oh, like yum until Okay, all right, fair, fair. I mean, I guess, lots of on and off. That's pretty much how we met. We met in high school. It took us a long time to finally date, but I mean. But, but even then, we were still sometimes dating. Like, when people ask us how long have you been together, it's like, it's either five yeah. or two and a half. Mm -hmm. So, I don't know. It's been a lot of ups and downs. But you know what, though? We're here, and I'm not a four anymore. And um, everything comes full circle. Like, Why did I you mean, think I was ugly? You had skinny eyebrows. <laughs> I had the worst eyebrows. I mean, it's just cool to see, because, like, we were together before I like dropped out of college. Think about how different my life is now compared to like when we were first oh, together. I know. Like she was with me like before like I did Instagram or like YouTube or anything. Like you know what before it was all of that. So like it's kind of crazy. I had a three hundred dollar neon. My uh, first car, like the car that I was driving, like I had like a three hundred dollar neon, and we used to like go drifting. Go drifting. Yeah, yeah. And now we're in the Wraith. In the what? We're in the Rolls Royce Wraith now. And it's just crazy that I came all full circle. One day. One day we'll look back at this and we'll be like, oh my God, remember when you just had your Beamer? See? Yeah. One day we're going to look back. I'm going to be like, damn, I had the Beamer and now I'm in the... We're doing the Do mukbangs and the though? Lamborghini. They're really good. It's not even about the food, but... No, it's good. Do you want the other one? Mm -hmm. I had three already. Okay, so I'm gonna wrap the video up here. I enjoy doing content like this and I plan on doing some more mukbangs in the new year. So if you guys are new, join the crew, subscribe to the channel, leave this video a like before you leave. I'm gonna catch you guys in the next video. Damn, whoa, you need a red carpet. You look like a